What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. So I reacted to Carmen's video. Uh, let me go to her channel. All about Carmen. Now, the reason I cannot react to her video is because she copyrights. I love to explain these things to y'all every time I do a video because y'all got to understand I'm at work, right? And I love y'all. Don't get me wrong. We have a tight relationship. The ones that rock with me that really understand, relationship is dope. Some of y'all don't understand. I'll be trying to get y'all to understand. So I try to tell y'all every day, this is the reason, all right? Uh, her team copyrights videos as they have the right to. I am not against them copyrighting videos. This is their discretion as it should be, okay? It's fine. So I react to them and I put them on Patreon. Now, this was the beginning of the video. Um, Kiana J was there. I don't, I, respectfully, I don't know the other lady. So, you know, I can't really say too much. Uh, I like the look, though. The look of this whole entire set was dope. Um, and I love the fact that Carmen had the black and white on everybody had on the black. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the, the theme was red and black. For those that don't know, my favorite colors are red and black together. If I could do a theme of red and black for everything I would. But anyway, they was basically giving Karma her flowers, telling her that, you know, she's been doing good. They've been seeing her blossom and things like that. And uh, for some of those that may think it's corny, you know, it's not. Honestly, um, some women actually endure certain things that I feel like they absolutely shouldn't, but we all are not the same. And honestly, that's something that needs to, kind of be respected and I didn't understand it till now uh with speaking to a lot of y'all but I do want to say this though if I could send a message to a lot of the women out here you are worth way more than um what you're getting especially if it's something that you disagree with right so if you're getting abused or if you're um in a situation that you just genuinely don't agree with or that, that you just genuinely don't feel good about, leave that shit. Leave it. Go. It's not worth it ever. Okay. Um, I know things are easier said than none. Yes. But y'all with a little bit of work and a little bit of faith, it's not your network. It's your network. So, you know, sometimes got to speak to some people some people out here that are willing to help you get through whatever it is that you're going through but you got to open your mouth all right so in all seriousness i want everybody to get that message in the beginning of the video because it is something else that we need to talk about but i want y'all to get that message in the beginning of the video it is very serious your health is very serious and um your mental is very serious so i want y'all to take that serious right so I like that. I thought it was dope. Kiana J did speak. Shout out to her. Um, y'all, we've been, I've been following Kiana J for a very long time. Um, I feel like she's grown a lot and I think it's pretty dope. So shout out to her. Now, this woman right here, can sing. Sing, whatever you want to call it. She got a voice on her. Um, this little situation that she got going on with Carmen, I think it's cool. I hope she's getting paid really good. I don't know. Right. So it's none of my business, but I do hope that she's getting paid really good because she does deserve it. I feel like. Um, and whatever role she's playing, I hope it, it gets her to where she needs to go. Like, say, for instance, she come out with another song. I would like to hear that song because she can sing. Right. So I hope they are willing to promote that as well, because I want to hear that song. Whatever song she come out with next, if it don't have nothing to do with Neb, if it don't have nothing to do with Carmen, I still want to hear her song. Definitely want to hear her song, right? So, baby, you got to have your ID, too. I want to hear her song. So, shout out to her. I think her name is Keita. Now, Carmen was listening to her. She was, you know, talking to her and, and uplifting her and things like that. Um, It's a blessing for Carmen to have women around her that respect her, right? I think all women deserve that. You know what I'm saying? I think all women deserve respect. Um, and I'm I'm happy that she can bask in her in her blessings and in her confidence. 
you know, with who she is, right? Um, women, people, I feel like deserve that. In this situation with Corey, I've watched Corey go on a, a, a rampage for the last, what, a hell, year. I've been watching Corey all year, but for the past, like, couple months, man, he will make you feel low. You know, some of these women, he'll make them feel so low. He say the worst things about them, and to be honest, I think he's hurting on another level because um, you hear it through his music. And I know, you know, some people may not like his music, but some of his music I have listened to, and he hurting too. He just got too much pride. Um, he has too much pride to actually admit what's going on with him mentally. Um, and amongst just him doing all the shit that he is doing, I think that I'm happy that Carmen got the hell away from it is where I'm trying to go. I'm happy that Karma got the hell away from it. She can bask in her independence and bask in, in her femininity. And she is feeling like a better person. You know, he's absolutely going through a downward spiral. I was in his shoes at one point. Um, and that's why I can relate now. Not too much. Cause he is a complete liar and I never been that. He's a complete liar and he never takes accountability for nothing. So I cannot believe I ever called myself a narcissist because I've never been that. Um, but when you really dive into the definition of what a narcissist is, that boy got a problem and he need to stand on business in that area. He's too busy focusing on being a real nigga. Um, when you don't have to focus on being a real nigga when you real, you feel me? Like you don't have to focus on that when a nigga real, they just are. When the nigga got to tell you all the time, I'm a real nigga. You're not a real nigga. You're not. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You too busy trying to be instead of just being that. Naturally, real niggas just real niggas. You know what I'm saying? And a real nigga tell you what's really going on in a situation with whatever woman they dealing with. So anyway, that happened right there. You know, she was crying. The lose to win was beautiful. Um, this woman can sing. That's why she got the ugly face on. She can sing. Um, Carmen was breaking down, you know, having a moment. Uh, they hugged it out, cried it out. Apparently Keita has gone through the exact same thing. So she was feeling it as well. Kiana J was crying. I don't know if she's been through it as well, but she's felt it as well. Now, y'all know I'm gonna have a funny part in the video. I'm gonna always have a funny part in the video. I guess this is the CEO of Neb. Right? I don't know his name. Uh, shout out to him if he is. You know, he handled his business. He helped Carmen and things like that. His haircut pissed me off. Hold on. I, I need to go to the part of his haircut where they... <laughs> Here it is. Here it is. Y'all, his haircut pissed me off. Now, I ain't gonna lie. It was to the point I thought it was fake. Damn, I was right on it. I was right on it. Y'all. I thought his hair, I thought my boy had on a 27 piece. I ain't gonna lie. I thought it was a 27 piece. Get to the damn. Y'all, I thought this was a 27 piece. No cap. Now, one of my good friends on the channel said that she thought, she said 27 piece. But I was asking everybody on the channel, is this a wig? Right? Because it was just like spread out. You know what I'm saying? The damn. The swoop, it just pisses me off. You know what I'm saying? And I know he's a hustler. He's a probably a multimillionaire, right? The nigga's a boss. Shout out to him. But he need to switch over to Barber. Because this pissed me off. This damn swoop was too, it was too loose. And then, don't get me wrong, that lineup was lining, okay? But on the side or whatever, I thought it was fake. I thought it was fake, y'all. That damn lineup pissed me off. I th th right here, this damn side right here, I thought it was fake. We had to continue to watch the video to realize. Hold on, let me get down in here. We had to continue to watch the video to get to the back of it because the, they should have blended it in to realize it wasn't fake at all, actually. Okay? 
It's, we ended up seeing the back of his head. But anyway, it wasn't fake at all. At least the back. That damn Nike swoop, I, that pissed me off. And if he was my friend, I would have said, bruh, don't pay him for this. This shit was too spaced out. But anyway, that's how aggravated I was with that. Okay? Like, I, hey, I, I always talk shit about myself. Because don't, hey, listen. Yeah, I got look, my shit all blind up in here. Not blind, but, you know, it's a little light up there. I hate that shit. So don't ever think I won't cut ass and not talk about myself. But all I want to say is, I feel like him as being a millionaire like that, you know, that nigga, she, yeah, no. I ain't like it. But then it happened. That's all I have to say about the whole situation. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Don't you take it? God damn it. Okay, baby, can you give me? Hey, Twain, nigga, let's say. Oh, whatever, bitch. Give me a second. She, she said we didn't invite her to the house warming. Oh, my God. That's honey sauce fault. That's honey sauce fault. You know you wouldn't have came anyway, bitch. You would have had something to do. Uh-huh. Saturday. Uh huh. We know next time. Good. How you doing? Okay. Honey sauce family is very, very family oriented. And if I didn't speak, it would have been a problem. But listen, y'all. I love y'all. We live on Twitch right now. We making. Um, we listening to. Use it vibing out, having a little bit of look, a little bit of wine, a little bit of little chips or something. And yeah, we're going to watch some police videos and go on about our business. Y'all let me know what y'all thinking down in the comment section below. Oh, the whole reason why I made this video. Go watch it on the Patreonski. Watch it on the Patreonski, okay? The link will be in the pinned comment. I'm going to put that in the beginning. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.